Oh hi, welcome back. Let's animate a pie chart in After Effects for your infographic videos, for example. Let's make a new composition, 1080p, 60fps, 15 seconds, click on OK. Afterwards, you uh, hold the left click button, and then you head over to Ellipse Tool, and then um, let's say if you want to color it um, light pink. Drag the cursor, and then uh, hold the control and the shift keys on your keyboard while you're doing so, so that it's large enough. Afterwards, right click on the shape layer, Head over to Transform, click on Center Anchor Point. Afterwards, right-click on the Shape Layer again. Head over to Transform, click on Center and View, just like this. Divide the circle into several sectors. We use Radial Wipe. Type in Radial under Effects and Presets, and then drag the Radial Wipe into the Shape Layer. So, uh, change the Wipe mode into Counterclockwise. Afterwards, you um you do it like this, 100%, and then let's animate this. For example, if you want the sector to finish revealing itself after like um 40 frames no 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 40 frames yeah turn on the stopwatch and then drag the time indicator to 40 frames and then let's say if you want to have this um 20% share 100 minus 20 equals 80 so type in 80 just like this copy it again and then make another sector well we have to do several uh, transitions so that it looks cool when we reveal each sector all right um Turn on the stopwatch for scale, and then let's say if you want to uh, decrease it by this, and then you um, simply do some um, easy ease. Okay, for uh, both of the transition and the scale, just like so. Afterwards, um, you copy it, and then you paste it, and then drag it after 40 frames, just like this. Let's say if you want to color it, for example, um, light green, just like this, and then you want to have this um, like 30%. Uh, so uh, change the transition completion to 70% because 100 minus 30 is 70. Afterwards you want to uh, change the starting angle to 72 because 1 fifth of 360 is 72 and then you do some tweaks with the size again. Zoom it for a little bit, just like this, and then copy and paste it again. And then uh, drag your time indicator 40 frames away, which is 60 frames, just like so. And then you want to change the color to, let's say, light blue. And then if you want to have this 25% um, of share, change the starting angle into 180. And then uh, 100 minus 25 is 75. And then you're done. And then uh, you want to do some tweaks with the scaling, just like this, for example. Afterwards, you copy it again and then uh, move the starting point of the frame, no, layer, like 40 frames away, just like so, and then um, from uh, the uh, the starting point of the previous layer, and then you drag the time indicator like 40 frames away. And then uh, let's say if you want to color it like um, yellow, and then uh, you want to have this 15% um, of share, 100 minus 15 would be 85. And then afterwards, you uh, change the starting angle to uh, 270, just like this. Well done now. And then uh, change the scaling a bit again. Afterwards, you copy and paste it again, and then drag it just like so, 40 frames away. And then uh, you drag it until it's 20, and then afterwards, uh, you want to have the remaining 10%. So uh, change the transition completion to 90%. Afterwards, you uh, change the starting angle to... 324 because 360 minus 36 which is a tenth of 360 degrees equals 324. Afterwards you want to color it for example orange and then you're done making the animation of your pie chart and then it may turn into this. Cool! You can add the numbers and then it may turn into this. No offense here. So that's how you can animate a pie chart in After Effects. Thank you for watching. Do drop a like if you enjoyed the video. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel. For me, it's good day. Ciao.